a very good afternoon. The shooting by a longtime city employee in a municipal building in Virginia Beach on Friday killed 12 people on three floors, making yesterday the most devastating day in the history of Virginia Beach. According to Virginia Beach Police Chief James Cavera, the shooting happened at 4 p.m. when the veteran employee of the Public Utilities Department entered a building in the city's municipal center and immediately opened fire upon all the victims. The police entered the building and got out as many employees as they could before exchanging fire with the suspect who was armed with a .45 caliber handgun and killing him in the process. Four others were wounded in the shooting, including a police officer whose bulletproof vest saved his life. Authorities did not release the suspect's name, instead choosing to focus on the victims during a news conference. An extended search will be continued to find the 21 people still missing after a boat carrying South Korean tourists was rammed by a cruise ship and sank into the river in Budapest. Divers in full equipment were unable to inspect the wreckage of the boat due to the extremely murky waters and heavy currents from recent rains. Foreign Minister Peter Sijarto, who visited the site of, of Wednesday's accident, said a protracted search needed to be prepared, adding that help from Serbia was also expected where the Danube flows after leaving Hungary. Sijarto said the 64-year-old Ukrainian captain identified only as UEC who protested was held as a suspect for endangering water transport leading to a deadly mass accident. According to Hungary authorities, seven people were so far confirmed dead and seven others were rescued. And that ends the World News at 2. I'm Shira Abang Mansour for TV Sarawak. Thank you for watching.